In June of 1998, in Los Angeles, California, a movie production was halted forever when the lead actor was killed by falling citrus. The feature film Father Forgiveness would never see the light of day due to the horrific consequences of malicious grapefruit. 20 years later, The legend continues. Grapefruit? More like grave fruit. Oh, wait. You ever heard about the legend? The legend? Yeah. Of the murderous grapefruit. Fucking grapefruit to take me out. I'm a fucking movie star. Starring James Henderson. Murderous grapefruit. How did it feel? Uh whenever you first uh, saw the grapefruit arrive on set? Yeah, I was a little skeptical, you know, yeah. but at the end it turned out great. I was uh, pretty intimidated by the grapefruit, um, but I, I think we made it work, yeah. you know? I think eventually we kind of became friends, kind of like, we knew that we were both actors and like, had to do our job kind of thing, so I think it worked out really well. Uh, well, when I first met the grapefruit, everything was just like cool, you know, and uh, it seemed, you know, like a normal grapefruit and was totally friendly and, you know, juicy and kind of sweet, but then the sour kicked in and it was just all of a sudden just more and more sour and, and then violent and, and angry and dropping, dropping on people and just, yeah, I don't know, I'll, I'll probably never work with the grapefruit again, for sure. Yeah, working with uh, with the grapefruit was fine. Uh, you know, he, he uh, works really hard. You know what? Fuck this. I'm not gonna lie. All right, the guy's a fucking asshole. He never did anything I asked of him. All I wanted that little shit to do was hit his mark and say his lines. And instead, he's just squirting everybody in the fucking eye all the time with his acidic attitude. He's dropping from trees. He's you know groping the women. I don't know who this fucker thinks he is. He's not at like A list. He's like D, Z at best. So I recommend nobody hire him. I know I'm supposed to do a puff piece on this fucker, but I can't stand it. All right? I'm never working with him again. Fuck that grapefruit. Yeah, as a production assistant, I can honestly say that working on this film with this grapefruit is uh, one of the worst experiences uh, of my entire life. I mean, he was really rude to everyone uh, from the moment he got on set. Uh, he was always constantly bringing his friends and his groupies around, uh, eating all the catering. Um, the grapefruit always took the last donut, which just isn't fair. Um, Whenever he's reading over his lines, uh, you know, he would just order everyone out. You couldn't be around him at all. Um, constantly doing drugs. I mean, it was a constant thing with him. 
if it wasn't one thing, it was another. And, um, you know, when I tried to tell him that that wasn't a good thing for his career, you know, not a good move, uh, he would just argue about how many uh, antioxidants that he had. And um, it, it was just all around the worst. Yeah, the, uh, the grapefruit. Yeah, he was a... Uh... It was all right to work with. I, I probably wouldn't do it again. He took a long time in makeup, and honestly, I don't think it takes that much time. He was always ordering us around, like, you know, this is the part when I fall, and if I'm not comfortable falling from the tree, like this harness, it was always about, like, checking the harness, and I get safeties first, but um, uh, I wouldn't recommend working with the grapefruit again. So. Yeah, you know, I, uh, I never worked with a grapefruit before. I was, I was kind of excited. You know, I never really worked with any kind of fruit, but I mean, he uh, he, he had this like sour attitude about himself. You know, it was just like, it's always like, you know, me, 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 and all this and that. And was, you know, you know, we're a community here, man. I mean, we're, we we share. I mean, you know, I, I, I'm a star. You don't see me, you know, going all high and mighty. Just uh, you know bigger than myself yeah you know I'm, I'm you know I may not be round or yellow or one whole shape you know I got feelings too man 10 minutes baby <laughs> oh my god hey what's up I uh I see you there no he's no he's, he's great he's, he's really great he's just uh, no 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 it's, I'm good I, I feel great I mean it's, it's a great experience Yeah, it was brutal, actually. The grapefruit kept saying, you're, you're blocking my light, you're blocking my light. And I wasn't even on set yet. <laughs> it's rough. Um, no, it's just... LA diva type of... I, I just don't want to talk about it anymore. Like, it's just going to give me grapefruit nightmares. Listen, like, you're not gonna be a star, okay? You're a freaking fruit. Get over it. I'm next, okay? Hello, can somebody just do my hair? Hello, can somebody just check my hair? Just to see if it's, it's okay? Because I'm, I'm doing, I'm on a close-up right now. Here, fruit basket. Oh, sorry, <laughs> thank you. Hi, so, um, I'm Chloe, and I play opposite of this, um, I don't want to say grapefruit because it would be really racist, but I don't know how else to call it. Um, yeah, I play opposite of that. How's been my how has my experience has been? I mean, ever since I came here from Malibu, I just feel like, you know, I've worked with like so many stars. Like I've worked with Tom Cruise, with uh, John Travolta, and this other actress. What was her name again? I don't know what her name was, but she's all boobs. But anyway, the point is, I've never, never worked with such a hard-working actor and also freaking annoying person. Um, I say person again, it's racist, but anyway, the grapefruit. You know, I'll, I'll admit, before the start of the shoot, I was a little nervous because I've been hearing from everyone what a terrible guy grapefruit is to work with. And I was expecting this total nightmare, but as we kept shooting, it was, it, it came clear to me that he's a pretty alright dude. Um, I, I think the grapefruit's great. 